It's Divine Darkness 81, and I know this is a face you haven't seen in a very long time, but I am officially back. Yay! Um, some of the things that had me really busy have kind of, you know, subsided, so I have a little bit more time on my hands, which is awesome. I can get back to doing this because I really started to enjoy it, and I hated having to take a break from it, but sometimes you just have to do that. Let's see, a um, few updates. Work is going well, still teaching, love it, love it. Um, I'm actually in school again, and this time it's not even education teaching related. I'm actually in a medical assisting program here in my area, and um, I went back to school a few years ago, got my master's degree in education, and you know, I just decided I wanted to know and be able to do something other than education and teaching. So that's what I'm doing. It's an 18 month program. I just started in January, so that's what had. Um, a lot of my time in January so I was doing that and then um, you know going back and forth between there between school and my actual work you know kept me really busy but now I have a little bit of calm time so I can get back into making videos um, let's see with my hair as you can see my hair is in uh, protective style I had I have these kinky twists and I had them done on um, February 1st, actually. I got them done on February the 1st, and today is, what, March the 21st, I think? So my goal was to keep them for two months. So <laughs> March 1st was the month, and it's hard because I I guess I got so used to planing my hair, and I'm so ready to take them out to, to get to plane my hair again. And, you know, the weather's getting warmer, so I'm really excited about getting back to my wash and goes in the morning, so... I'm going to try to hold out until, um, until I'd say maybe about April 1st or whatever so I can get my two months in. Because I paid too much for these to take them out too early. So you know how that is. Um, I'm actually going to make another video about the African uh, braiding shop that I went to. And it's not even a rant. It's more of a hallelujah about the experience that I had there. And I really should have made this a while ago. But, you know, I had to do it when, when time allows. So... You, the next video you see will probably be about um, my good experience at the braiding shop. So um, that's really about it. Um, I guess I will talk briefly about um, what I've been doing with my my braids after um, I get done with this video. While I'm you know talking about what happened at the braiding shop, so I just wanted to get on really quick and give you guys a very quick update about what's been going on in my life and let you know that I'm still alive and I do want to say thank you very very much to all that have subscribed and all my older subscribers that stayed on the whole time thank you very much so with that I'm gonna go now and you guys have a good one bye